So since Sunday, today is Wednesday, I've been camping here at the uh, Zuni Mountain Trail System. It's in the Cibola National Forest outside of Gallup, New Mexico, and it has been wonderful. It's a little bit windy today. You might be able to hear the wind and the camera, but um, that's okay. I just got done with two perfect days of weather. Uh, both Monday and Tuesday were just sunny and calm and mild and uh, just made for some absolute great mountain biking. So um, yeah, that's really one of the things that drew me out here was the trail system. Uh, there's, there's probably, I don't know, 40, 50 miles of trail that can be ridden in this area. So over the past couple days I've been exploring the trail system. It's really fun. It's not very technical, but if you like smooth, flowy, uh, single track without really any steep climbing uh, this is a great place for you there's certainly elevation out here but nothing steep all the climbs that I've done have been just very gradual and very easy and uh, really easy to do but uh, just great well-built single track for mountain bikes so no complaints there um, as far as uh, this area there's been nobody out here I've had the whole place to myself for a total of uh, what three days now and uh, just can't beat that so and even when I'm on the trails there's nobody out there I've seen a couple people at the trailhead but other than that absolute seclusion in this gorgeous forested campsite it's still a little bit deserty out here like if I just drop down the road um, 100 or 200 feet you're gonna start seeing cactus some yucca more junipers um, just kind of what you would expect for a, a desert campsite so um, I wanted to talk a little bit about last weekend. So uh, Friday and Saturday, I made my way into Albuquerque and visited my friend Paul Chin. Uh, he's an old Inflexible riding buddy of mine uh, from the Inflexibles Riding Group. And it was absolutely great to see him. He let me crash on his couch for a couple days, take a shower, cook some food. Uh, we went out for dinner one night, got some drinks and it was absolutely wonderful to uh, catch up with my friend Paul Chin. Uh, Paul, if you happen to see this video, thank you very much. Uh, really enjoyed my time in Albuquerque, as always. So, um, also wanted to talk about my cooking. So, uh, behind me you can see kind of my cook setup. Um, I have a Coleman grill and a Coleman stove. Uh, both are working fantastic. I can cook on both at the same time. I got this amazing cook stand right here that's been working great. Um, not everybody knows this, but I am on a special diet. I follow loosely follow a paleo diet, so essentially whole foods. I eat very, very healthy. And so far since I've been on the road, I've been able to really whip up some amazing healthy meals. Um, truthfully, I feel like I'm eating probably healthier than when I was at home. So uh, that's been really nice. The other day I made some fermented cabbage. Um, I'm starting to make some bean sprouts. So um, excited to get uh, those, those good foods in my system. So. Yeah, uh, wanted to talk about my sleep as well. Uh, you know, this is almost my second week sleeping in the van dedicated, and my sleep has been great. I was a little concerned about the futon that I bought, whether it was gonna be any good, um, and it's been absolutely comfortable. Not only that, it's super versatile. I can flip it up and it becomes my couch, kind of a chair, and that is also uh, really comfortable and nice as well. So that's been working out great, and uh, what else can I tell you? Yeah, so far the van's been really good. I had my awning up the past couple days. Today got windy, so I put it away. The awning's been a really nice feature to the van, so uh, been enjoying having that. And the added shade and just makes the van camp seem a little bit bigger, a little bit more. It's, it's been a great addition to that. So anyways, uh, as far as my next move, I'm gonna be heading into Arizona um, within the next couple days. Probably Friday, I'm gonna be leaving. I wanted to stay into the weekend, but it looks like uh, the weather's gonna make a turn for the worse. We're looking at 40 degrees um, as a high on Friday. Not too excited about that. And then uh, tomorrow, we're looking at 30 mile per hour plus wind gusts, and uh, I'm not a huge fan of the wind. So uh, today, it looks like it's gonna be a little bit windy, but not too bad. It's gonna be in the 70s, and I'm definitely gonna be getting in a bike ride. Um, pretty much after I make this video. So um, I'm gonna put my clothes on and probably get about a 20 mile ride in. There's some trails I wanna check out. Um, and uh, I'm really excited to ride some more of this park.
Don't jump her. 